Lecturing each other and directing everyone to their right path. The green teams of PLT Green Schools are led by the students, and they are the ones to determine what, how, and when to take action. The students are hands-on, which reinforces what they have learned in the classroom. When students are in the driver's seat, they are more likely to care about their projects. This helps them become better environmental stewards as they become more informed and more active citizens. Students who are active are students who are learning. PLT Green Schools increases their environmental literacy and their problem-solving skills. It has taught me more about critical thinking. I've learned that being a green leader takes perseverance and patience, especially whenever the weather decides to change your plants. The responsibility of being leaders encourages students to pass on their environmental knowledge. Some students have discovered ways to reach out to their communities to raise awareness of ecological concerns. Others have had success teaching younger students. I went to a local elementary school and teach children gardening, fitness, and reading. I made a zine. It's like a poster that informs people about fitness and how they can be better and live better lives and everything. You'd be amazed how many kids don't go into these fields that we need somebody to go into because they're discouraged as a younger kid. And that's what we want to do with the kids we go and mentor. We want to encourage them in their interests and their likes. The younger students gain knowledge from the older students, and the older students gain the confidence to get better and better about spreading the word. Few schools have had as much success spreading the word and growing their program as Two Rivers Magnet Middle School East in Hartford, Connecticut. Within three years, the green team grew from two students to 150 members, which makes up almost one-third of the student body. Here, the green team visits local elementary schools to teach them how to compost and recycle. However, students working in action projects become inspired to implement many kinds of ideas at home and in their neighborhoods. Even something as simple as planting a tree. I planted one in front of my house, a peach tree, to show my community that if I can plant one, you can plant one too. Then just one tree could help the whole community. Leading by example can be effective, and some green teams have found simple ways to take it to the next step by giving their entire student body opportunities for hands-on participation. At Washington Yu Ying School in Washington, D.C., all of the students participated in an Earth Day Pledge project. First, they tied strings around several of the trees on their school grounds. And then you would get your card and you would write down something like I wrote that I pledge to recycle as much as I can and you would put it on your string. With so many action projects that students can develop, PLT Green Schools can help students determine their future. Careers I have an advantage on now are forestry, geology, master compost, vegetation specialist, teaching, and many more I have yet to learn forestry, wildlife management, hydrology, etc. I always knew that I wanted to go into the science field, but this program has also helped me look into other career pathways that I may consider. Empowering students to take action gives them skills they will use for the rest of their lives. Being part of Green Schools has opened my eyes to careers such as agricultural engineering and civil engineering that I never even thought of pursuing. 